Should do it. Yeah. Chapman gets the save. Speeds gets the win. He's ten and two. Pirates are five and zero against the fifth this year. But thank goodness that they held the runner at yeah. third, because uh, you know who knows what could have happened. Uh, I, I think you got to take the gamble there. But hey, that's a nice win for the Pirates. I guess that's if you want to draw up a way to win a ball game. You have Skeens on the mound. Uh, you give them an early lead with the homer. You take advantage of a miscue by the Marlins to add a couple more on. You have Skeens pitch six strong innings, and you have the back end of the bullpen come in and, and do what they do. I mean, that's, that's kind of what we've expected from this team most of the year, really, with the starting pitching. Just score a few runs, get the starter through six, let the, the bullpen close it out. And, and that's pretty much what we saw today. You know, a little scary there in the ninth inning. <laughs> but it don't uh, come easy. Yeah, it did come easy. But again, I, yeah, that's... But you're right. That is the way you draw it up. If you're a Pirates team, that's what you got to do. Yeah, that's what you'd like to see. You know, get a couple runs early. Pitcher, starter goes deep. And, you know, what a great job again by Skeens. Just, um, you know, showing what he could do with the velocity, the secondary pitches and everything else like that. And uh, also nice to see O'Neill going big fly for the first time in a month. It was a big home run in the first inning. He had traveled 444 feet, and he's downstairs with Hannah. O'Neill, it's been exactly a month since you watched the ball.